Good evening everyone and welcome to Ferry Carrick Park for tonight's SSE Artricity League First Division clash between visitors Kerry FC and the home side Wexford. The club's down and it's great for them to come down and see the lads and you know maybe think like that could be me out there one day so I've seen it here a couple of weeks back the Enniscorti crowd were here obviously with Aaron being from the area and they were loving it after the game just you know seeing an idol I suppose it's a great strike by oh. Kerry and what a goal there what a strike there by Kennedy Amechi. He seems to be everywhere we look out, Mark. He's yeah. up front, he's in midfield, he's on the edge of his own box. He's really putting it in. Yeah, it's obviously something like we, like we touched on in the first half and I'm sure kind of the management has seen as well that it was a bit flat. If the ball comes out here, chance for a strike and it's a great strike again. And, and it's in the back of the net, that's 2 nil. And it's come from another long strike, Mark. Yeah, so it was a lovely strike there by Martin Coughlin on the left foot. Oh, Mason's made a save and it's fallen in the box and Kennedy's reacted quickest and Wexford are 2-0 down. Keno Malley. Oh, Malley Again, free header by Ethan Boyle and it's 1-0. Boyle. That's the long throw we were speaking about. You know, we kind of mix it up a little bit. A couple went short. It's been a couple of times that Ethan has found himself free in that box. And they find him really, really well. They did that time and Wexford have a free now off this. And Larry Levinson is in. Aaron Dobbs and, and he gets one. one. Like I said, Mick, chances will keep falling to Dobbsy and he will put one away. As I mentioned before, we had a previous kind of instance in earlier on. Ball into that space. No one attacked it. Dobbsy's in there now and it's 2 2 here in yeah. Ferry Carrick. Like I said, just coming up to 78 minutes gone. We imagine there'll be maybe another three or four added on, depending on what the fourth official. Well, true. Danny Furlong is in here. William Shields it back to the keeper. Danny's oh, done well. Keeper's it's a penalty. Down there, sure. It's a, it's a penalty. penalty. Yeah, it's it had to be. penalty for Wexford. That's a brilliant run there by Danny Furlong. Referee just settling things here now. It's Danny Furlong with the penalty. And it's 3-2 Wexford. Wexford. Goal 118 for Danny Furlong in a Wexford jersey. So, fans in Coleman's Park seeing plenty of goals. <laughs> Yeah, it should be easy here for Owen Mason and you know, should take this into his box now in another few seconds. The referee is just blown for full time here, so 